welcome back so guys today i come with a different thing to do i'm in a different country can you guys try and guess the country or at least the continent let me give you some tips the country is known for having a blue white red black the name of the country starts with the letter u some of you guessed it right. It's United States of America, where everything is big. So my first time in America, so I've been experiencing some cultural shock. And I'll be sharing every single detail with you guys. So far, so good. I'll be taking you guys along, going around, having fun, getting to know new things. I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to share, subscribe, and like the video. Welcome to Ethiopia. Guys, can you believe this is Africa? It's so beautiful, so clean, so organized. Oh, I advise you all to come to Ethiopia, Addis Ababa. I just checked in my hotel room and I'm taking you guys along. I'm starting with the room tour. This is Hi, this is my outfit for today. Uh, from 1 to 10, how much you give to that comfy airport outfit? This is the bed. I already messed up a little bit. This is the room, the very simple room with a classic decoration. This is the TV. And what big celebrate that we? It's the view, guys. It's the view. Could you imagine that Ethiopia is so beautiful? So clean and so organized. Did you know that we have places in Africa like that? Yes, today I'm showing you. I'm just passing by Ethiopia for a transit to Dubai. So here we go. Another 16 hours and then we get to the US. In total, we're about 24 hours to get to the final destination. The first thing I've noticed when I arrived was how developed the infrastructures are and how fast-paced the lifestyle is. San Antonio is a modern, vibrant city, rich in a heritage with colorful personality across three centuries. It's a unique mixture of native Mexican, German, and Spanish influence. The downtown loop of San Antonio River Walk is a stretch of beautiful landscapes, waterfronts that featured many of San Antonio's most popular hotels, restaurants, nightclubs, bars, shopping centers, and businesses. This is the River Center Mall. It's a shopping mall located in downtown San Antonio, Texas. It's a pretty crowded environment full of tourists and you get the chance of knowing more about the historical part of San Antonio's infrastructures and much more. I am having such an amazing time. I'm just here seated, seeing many people outside enjoying the view, learning a lot about the historical side of San Antonio. I advise all of you guys to come one of these days, visit San Antonio, because I expect you to experience this such a nice historical view of America. Here we are at the next stop, the bowling club. So when we entered, as you can see, we stop at the reception, do the payment, pay for the shoes. There's a really special place. There's also an arcade, as you can see, a lot of tables. You can have lunch. So this one was my first try and I got it wrong. The second one, the same thing no points i was the last but after trying four or five times i got it right 
I was good on this. So after that, I decided to go skating. I had so much fun. Back to Houston, one of the most popular city, the house of skyscrapers. So this is the gallery mall. I just came to do some errands, do some shopping. As you can see, the mall is huge. It has many stores, so I decided to go to H and M for some things to wear. As you know, your girl <laughs> likes uh, going shopping. So I was just checking some shoes. I had some clothes. This is some of the clothes I tried. And yeah, I got a cheese, I paid, and now I'm going to the next one. Yeah, I'm just looking at the mall in the front so I was like, I can't leave this place without entering this room. I was at a good session because, you know, if you're a slim girl here, you can also buy in the kids session. So, after just went down to the adult session and unfortunately i got so late to the store it was already time that they were about to close the store but i got to buy two things i couldn't leave like that without trying and yeah so this is the case is a fast food station we stopped as you can see you can serve your own drink with your own eyes and here I'm just trying to show how people can serve their own drinks with some eyes you have many options of sodas these coffee after that you can get a cover and yeah go in and pay your drink I had to grab some chips. We are about to put gas in a car. And in America here, you don't see anybody from the work for you. So you do it you do it yourself. Just gonna see a quick movie here with the car. The movie just started five minutes ago. I'm in the hurry, rushing to the cinema room so I can catch up. The movie was fun now i'm heading to ultra this is a store for beauty if you love to smell like a sweet candy you should try the brazilian crush 62. 71 i'm not uh, a fan of it but 40 it smells so so good. left the store just grabbed a few stuff I'm gonna try Mexican food for the first time in my entire life. No, I think it's the second time because the first time was like charcoal. My auntie beat some of me. But today is in a special Mexican restaurant. This place is a typical traditional Mexican restaurant. As you can see the decoration, the food as well. It's quite homemade traditional way. I honestly didn't know what to eat. But I have asked for some suggestions. I had the starters, and then this is the meal I've choose. The meal is composed by some salad, rice, beans, and some meat, shrimps, and chicken, all mixed in some veggies. 
and guacamole. Guacamole is like a mix of avocado and some vegetables. This is the food my cousins had. Everything was so, so delicious. It was my first time trying this special dish. I loved it. I had to put some of the meat, veggies, beans and rice on the tortilla, this white bread you see on my hands, and wrap it and eat it. This was definitely a great choice. Today I came to the supermarket to buy some groceries. At this point, I'm searching for the showers because they are my favorite food. So far, they look fresh and delicious. Of course, I'm taking them. Grabbing some flowers, of course. Ladies, right down here. Which one are your favorite flowers? We are on our way to the Mexican store to grab some fresh vegetables straight from Mexico as you can see and here I found some products from Angola grabbing some Mexican pastries of course I'm just having some of the donuts I don't know if it's nice but I'm gonna try done pastry right here it's called pan oh it's pan <laughs> yeah Hi guys, so today is the next day. Today I'm just staying home. I didn't plan to go out today but I have to because we are celebrating uh, my cousin's birthday and so we choose to come outside spend the day. So guys we just arrived to celebrate my little cousin's birthday. <laughs> so we are here. We came with his friends and family. We're gonna have a pool day. The pool is right there waiting for us. He's 6 p.m. It's still pretty hot. The sun still up. It's summer, that's why. But like by this time in Africa, it's already dark. It's night, but here it's still sunny. <laughs> Today is the next day. I'm about to go out. I just got ready. This is my outfit. I'm going to watch, watch a basketball game. And I'm taking you guys along. I hope you enjoy today's vlog. This Sunday is a calm day. Nothing much happening. But yeah, here we go. Just got to the place. We had a walk for a few minutes. So that's where we're gonna play. It's been a sunny, relaxing day outside. I appreciate for staying till the end of the video. Thank you for watching. See you.